Hello everyone, David from Gold Star Tool and uh, we are gonna try to make some of these belt loops. I'm gonna go work with a um, folder called S66 one and one quarter. I mean, we are, I'm gonna show you how this thing works, but the folder name is S66. Now, um, how does it work? And these are the belt loops that you usually have on, you know, like those belt loop on your waist band. On the jeans. On the jeans. Yeah. But this is a fatter one. This is what? This is um, uh, about three quarter. Usually they're smaller, but it all depends on your bias. So this bias, uh, as you see here, is a one and one quarter going in, okay? And what comes out is three quarter. I will just, I just show you what I made. Uh, but you could do it one inch. You could have a one inch one, but then you have to have a smaller folder or a three quarter folder or a half. You know, it all depends uh, what size is your bias. bias and what size you want finished. But nevertheless, a lot of people need a belt loop, different types. So uh, you could, use it for any industry. Now, this is a double needle machine uh, and we're gonna use it on this machine. Now, this is Juki brand, but it doesn't really matter, okay? As long as you have two needles going down this way and you have a place for the foot to play or the folder to go, then you're good. This is, again, a one and one quarter. And the way you do it, you just you could adjust this way, up and down, and that way, left to the right. And I have this uh, regular thumb screw here. Now it might need a little bit, a little, a little bit of adjustment when you're going in. Um, I'm gonna just pull this out and show you how it works. Very simple. I'm gonna do a variety of series of folder videos because people like that. Um, cut the, again, if you go to our website, there are different sides of folders. This happened to be one and one quarter. I just took one from the shelf and I had my assistant cut me a bias and that's it. But if you want smaller, then you go one inch or three quarter, okay? But remember, our gauge set here, the space between the two needles are quarter inch. So you gotta do something that that quarter would fill into the bias belt loop. All right, go ahead and put this in, push it down, all right. I'm gonna like, tie it with my every time I do it before we make a video, everything works bam, hundred percent done, perfect. As soon as I wanna do go. Doo -doo. First, put this in first, and then I'm gonna pull it from the so the idea is for this 
to be like this. And then you just obviously pull it. And if it's a little bit different, sidewise, then it's not gonna come out good. So that's why I wanna adjust it, make sure. All right, here we go. Is it on? Now. Now, this is the front, this is the back. Let's go ahead. And that's how they make the uh, belt loop. Now, this one, the left one, I gotta adjust. It seems that it's a little bit off. And then when they wanna pull, just pull it like that. Yeah, let me do one more. So this is a belt loop S66 that works on the um, for the double needle machines. Double needle sewing machine, S66. Um, there are variety, variety of uh, different type of feet. I mean, folder bias for this machine, but this is one of them. I, we were having shipping this machine out to a customer today, and I thought I'm gonna just make a quick, quick video. here and this is here and I'm gonna see I'm going slow I'm not doing anything else now you see I just want to show you if I go a little bit left to the right then the other thread goes in the middle. The adjustment should be that both of them go to the uh, again. So if you sit down and you think somebody sits down and bring the two lips together and goes one stitch, no. Look at this. Front, back. That's how you make a belt loop. Beautiful done. You see? S66, this is one and one quarter. Again, if you go to our website, you see variety of it. I'm doing this on a jean. And then obviously you show this thing on whatever you want. Another great video, right? What? Please write down your comments, write a uh, thumbs up, share, like our videos, and make a comment if, how do you like it? What do you think, what type of video should we do? Uh, thank you for watching and have a- Golden day. Have a golden day, thank you.